Now you start off just by sauteing some onion, slice it finely. I'm gonna grate a little bit of garlic into there as well. And we kind of look down a bit on Turkish food, I think, actually. We, can't, we think it's just kebabs, don't we? No, we do not. Oh, don't, well, you wouldn't, actually. No, we actually. do not. What do you think when you hear Turkish food, Matthew Ford? Well, I think of all those delicious pastries for a start. What's surprising is that, um, it, you know, in the, during the Ottoman Empire, it was such a kind of, well, it was a, it was a huge, big thing. I mean, poets and musicians and chefs all kind of ranked a bit like nowadays. And I also that Turkey itself was a sort of meeting point for both a Asia and Europe. So you've got a whole lot of... In we, I we know, from all over the place. And did, did, you, did you know also that it was mostly slaves that cooked in the kitchens? Stock on top. And women still hardly ever cook in professional kitchens there. Because all of the chefs, they thought the best ones came from this place called Bolu this region of Turkey, and people yeah. still think that, but it was all men who left home when they were about, kind of, you know, 13, went to the kitchens, went back to Mare, to Bolu, then went back to Istanbul again to cook. <laughs> right, so that's the bulgar wheat. Stock goes in, you just let that simmer for about 15 minutes, and then the next thing to do is tomatoes. Tomatoes go very sweet anyway when they're roasted slowly, but I just kind of help it with a little bit of brown sugar and some arisa, rose arisa, the Bella Zoo one is absolutely lovely. Um, and olive oil. Just going to mix those in together in a bowl. And you can have these as kind of hot or not as you like. Why do you use brown sugar rather than caster sugar or demerara? I just, they make them go a bit dark and I like that kind of brown sugary taste. <laughs> Don't you? <laughs> is I that, need to be convinced. Is that funny, Matthew? I'm just you, if you so make particular. it, you can use caster sugar, OK? Fine, OK. Fine. Uh, a little bit of balsamic as well, which is completely un-Turkish. But who cares? Well, you probably do. Try and get tomatoes as well, which are, you know, good-flavoured plum tomatoes for this. So those just, they take about 35 minutes, depending on the size of them, about 180 degrees. And are they just supposed to be softened, or do they go... You know, they go quite... nice, they kind of... They go softened and they go very kind of shrunken and caramelised. 